Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, please subscribe down below. And honestly, it wouldn't be me if I didn't do something. So right before I started, I knocked over half of my desk because my ring light fell on top of it. So, you know, gotta have some excitement. Um, it is currently 5.50, or 4.50 in the morning. And we are getting ready to go to Louisville, Kentucky, which is a pretty fair, decently long distance from where I live. It's more because it's a, it's a decent uh, distance from where I live, but then we also have the time change between where I live and there, so we have to get up early to go to the children's hospital, and um, I am exhausted. Um, first of all, yesterday, which actually it feels a lot better, um, I stabbed myself in the eye with a tree. Um, that was an accident, obviously, um, but like the person I was working with was like, are you okay? And I was like, yeah, I can still see. We're good. We're good. We we can keep going. My eye didn't even get red. It's just irritated like there's a piece of branch or something in there. I don't know. But the, the tree definitely went through my eye. Um, but yeah, that, that definitely happened. I was like, great. Love that. Love that for me. Um, my car did end up getting fixed. Like the hatch works now. So that's good. I'm pretty happy about that because I was I was feeling pretty bummed um so in case you weren't aware I don't know why you would be because I didn't say anything but um I am using the products that I just got in my new boxy charm I've not gotten to use any of them but I have gotten the box and the first thing that I've already started using is this little concealer beauty blender and these Luxie brushes, which I have tons of Luxie because of BoxyCharm and I absolutely love the brand. So I'm excited about that. Next thing I'm going to use is this uh, Proof is in the Pudding palette because it looks so cute. I seen it, I was like, aw. Aw, the colors are a little, like, boring, but, like, I don't know, that's been my vibe here lately. And, like, two years ago when I really started posting on um, YouTube, I just, you couldn't get me into, um, like, neutral colors very much. I mean, I liked them, but I was like, you know what? I want these bright, beautiful colors Nobody does these bright, beauty, beautiful colors except for Jeffree Star. And I want some bright, beautiful colors. Like, that's what I'm here for. But then the pandemic hit, and I really wasn't doing makeup very often. And when I was, I was just really trying my best to look halfway decent and, like, being absolutely dead. And then, <laughs> um being absolutely dead from work, like working constantly and then having to try and like wear a mask on top of your makeup, it just kind of ruined everything. So I, I was like, you know what? The least is best because then I don't, I don't have to put quite as much effort in, which is what I started doing. And like neutral colors just happen to be easier. I still like my pop of color. It's just so much more convenient to do a neutral color. I am using warm cocoa right now. And I'm just kind of creating that like triangle, trying to go into the crease. Oh man. What side of TikTok is everybody on? Because I have been 
in a mix of things and like my algorithm used to be all funny videos and then it, somehow it got into like drama TikTok, which like, don't get me wrong, it's not wrong. Like I like watching drama, I just don't wanna be in it. Um, but now it's in like the drama TikTok where it shows me people talking about old TV shows like uh, Teen Mom, which I'm not mad about, <laughs> but also I'm like, why? Like what in my, what about me says that I, I want nothing but um, Teen Mom recaps. And like, it really messed with me because I used to send funny videos back and forth to people. And like, nobody wants a Teen Mom recap except for me. I kind of need the, um, the funny videos every once in a while, those. Not just for me, like, or not just for other people, for me too, because they make me laugh. And then I'm sitting here, like, in my car on my break, like, laughing like a hyena, a hyena with no one around, so. I'm sitting there trying to convince a coworker that she also needs TikTok. I'm like, listen, if you get TikTok, I'm going to be sending you some stupid, stupid videos. Like, let's just be real. I'm going to send you some stupid videos. That's just the way it is. You're going to get dumbass videos from me, and that's okay. I'm going into mango pudding now. Oh man, this week has been crazy busy, which it's, it's a good thing because, you know, we don't usually do the stuff we've been doing. We, um, we went to eat with my friend at a local pizza place and hung out and watched karaoke, um, which we don't normally do, um, especially the hanging out with friends part, just because our lives are so crazy and like don't align enough to go do stuff. It's mostly my work schedule. Because Nathan's off, but so usually that doesn't happen, and it was fun. It was nice, but yeah, you don't usually get to do that because um, just work schedules and everything don't always work out, or just forgetting to ask. Whatever, I I am trying to blend like a smooth line here, and it's just you can tell where I originally put it down and I'm like, I want seamless. <laughs> but yeah, we went to a pizza place and ate and then we went uh, skating the next night and then they all came over and the kids played on the bouncy house and in our, in our basement, which I guess is our bedroom now. And we have the projector and like a PlayStation down there. So it's not it sounds weird out of context, but like it's normal. And then I worked the last couple of days, which has got me exhausted, but um, like it's been good. The kids have been able to have fun and hang out, which like I said, we don't usually get to do because of work and whatnot. Going back into mango pudding to try and like this eye look doesn't look bad, it's just not what I want. I'm getting frustrated. We're gonna go into bread pudding. And hopefully like, I don't know, blend this out. There's still like a weird line. I really want to go on a vacation, but I'm also trying to save my money. Well, let me tell you, some there are some days I'm like, man, I'd rather be broke. I want to go lay on a beach somewhere and relax. I am so sick of being at work or I'm so sick of 
doing this, like, ugh, if I could just, if I could just run off to the beach. There are some days I just would. I would just go. Leave the problems to somebody else. We're gonna go into almond jelly. Kind of put it under. Right there. look bad kind of helps it blend just a little bit more and it's not sticking the greatest mm, let's go into spiced caramel bring that in a little bit And then we'll go into butterscotch just a little bit right there. Okay, so far, not the hugest fan of the, the palette itself. It's just not, like the colors are pretty, but they're just not, they're not holding up. I feel like they would literally just fall off with a drop of a hat. Chill. That's disappointing. I want to see how well this works. I want, I want it to dry before I have to, like, do anything, so... We're gonna give it time. This is a clear fill and shape eight hour brow gel. So I'm gonna see how well it works. I was thinking, man, that thing is flimsy. Nope, turns out it's just part of the gel. They look like they're holding pretty decently. Um, I got a brow conditioner in the box, which I used last night because I looked at this box before, <laughs> before I filmed just because, I don't know, here lately I haven't like been overly excited about all the boxes like none of them have been terrible it's just not been like oh I can't wait to try this out I can't wait to film I can't wait no it's just been like oh that's nice cool 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 so but today I end up getting um, a foundation. So I'm going to put on some um, 
primer and all the good stuff to to get my my face ready. The uh, boxy charm hasn't really sent me anything like so exciting that I'm just like I can't wait to to show everybody and like see what they think and you know if if I'm using it wrong or whatever usually I'm like oh well, that's cool I guess um but today they sent me a, or yesterday I guess they sent me a foundation so I guess that's worth you know I'm, I'm excited to to share that and whatnot that business business and keep your business clean I don't even know what that song is I don't I don't, know. I don't listen to it but it keeps popping up on my TikTok so it is a little bit stuck in my head it is a little bit stuck I want the e.l.f. primer because then it's sticky, 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 sticky. I'm not trying to have anything leave my face. Five eighteen. We're not doing terrible. This is two thirty neutral, I guess. Two thirty in. It's from Rare Rare Beauty. So we're about to see. It's a little yellow so far. I think it might be a little dark. The applicator. I don't know if I'd like that over time, especially if I had a breakout. Which I'm sure I do, because my breakouts don't look like, I don't know, some, to me they do, but to other people my breakouts don't look like regular breakouts. Like, anytime I have pimples or whatever, people are like, oh my gosh, your skin is so clear. And I'm like, I can't tell if you're, if you're serious or if you're joking, but... It is definitely not clear. This is probably going to end up being a summer shade, but that's okay. Um, the coverage isn't bad. I wouldn't say it's full coverage. Oh man. Look at me yellow. Oh, in the name of science. Beauty science. I think I'm gonna add a wing to this eye though. Look at how yellow I am. Oi. <laughs> I could be a member of The Simpsons today. Oh. 
was telling my uh, fiance how like, um, back when the movie came out, people were competing to um, see who won like Simpsons Springfield because like in no ep episode did they directly say which state they're from. Um, and multiple states have uh, Springfield. And um, he was like, no. And we get to watching and like, they're, every time they're, they go to show where they're from, like the map rolls up or they pan away or, you know. And uh, he uh, came back to me uh, later and he was like, so the Simpsons live, and I don't even remember where he said, to be honest. Um, but he said there's um, a conspiracy theory on YouTube and this guy like explains his conspiracy in full as to why it has to be this state and I was like oh okay nothing is sticking to my face right y'all maybe it's me am I the problem am I the drama So this one expanded a lot and everything, but I just, I don't know, it's still a little hard. It doesn't feel like my regular blenders that kind of just, I don't know, just form to my skin or whatever. I don't know. That's probably a terrible explanation, but <clears throat> it makes sense in my head. Okay, so far, I'm not liking the palette. I actually don't like what my makeup's doing at all today, but I actually don't like what my makeup is doing at all today. But we're just gonna keep rolling with it because we're already here. And we can't go back because I've gotta leave soon. Hopefully my friend doesn't mind the shirt that I, not that there's like anything offensive or anything with my shirt, but hopefully she doesn't mind that I'm just wearing like a shirt and some yoga pants because, I don't know. And I was like, you know, this will be cute. And then I got to thinking about it. I was like, what if it just looks lazy? Me always second guessing every single thing that I do. If you hear that in the background, that is my blind and deaf dog. She often, well not often, most of the time she knows where she's going. So it's kind of weird actually that she's running into walls. If you hear the background noise, it's actually my dog. Um, she's blind and deaf. so. Um, but she's been that way since birth, so usually it's not actually a problem. I think it's just weird for her because we've reconfigured the house. Um, this used to be my son's room, and uh, she used to spend a lot of time in here, like, you know, laying at the foot of his bed or wherever. Um, and now... I'm in this spot and I think it's just throwing her off a little bit because she's like waiting outside the door, but like also doesn't seem like, I don't know. And she, she scratches herself often, so. It's almost as if she has nothing else to do being deaf and blind. I know I just woke up, but I am so ready for a nap. Like, you could tell me it's time to go to bed, and I'd be like, okay. Um, the skating the other night really, really wore me out. 
I'm feeling my age, um, especially when I go to do things that like, you know, a couple of years ago, I don't think it would have bothered me to go do. It wouldn't have like drained on me so much, but I feel like in the past couple of years, especially, I have been extremely hard on my body. Like, literally just abusing the crap out of my, my body at work so that I can get things done. It's just... It's just the way it's been. And, like, whatever. No big deal. But, like, I am constantly, always, and forever exhausted. Eyebrows are, like, literally... I feel like I used to have no problem doing them and then like now I struggle so hard. I don't know if it's just because I stopped doing them for so long. Like literally any length of time you quit doing them you're like what the fuck am I doing? This is way blocky. Right? This, this looks stupid as hell. And before you know it, you have two very uneven cubes at the end. And you're like, what the fuck have I done to my face? This monstrosity called my eyebrows. My eyes watering, the, especially the one that uh, I got the tree stuck into. Or, I guess, poked with a tree. Oh man, that is going on nicely. Watch me fuck it up here. Beautiful. So anybody watch the the BS we see on TikTok? I mean, not specifically that, like, because I know that's a thing, but like all the drama going down with the um, mascara. Oh my gosh, everybody is losing their stuff over mascara or they were at least and I was like honey it's just mascara calm your tits life will go on near far away It's probably not the lyrics, but like that's what I sang as a kid. And that's probably what I will always sing. Like, um, from the window to the kitchen. Put some barbecue on that chicken. Actually, I knew that wasn't the words to that, but I was so used to singing it. That's what I sing a lot of the times on accident. Now, and then, uh, Mama Rollin' Them Bodies. I used to sing, Mama Rollin' Them Biscuits Hot and Fresh Out the Kitchen. That I literally, really did think was, was what was being sing, sung. It's weird how we remember things and, like, they're so different from, like, how they really are, like, just like a Mandela effect, you know? So many people can have the same account of something and be completely wrong. And like, then there's probably me who has the wrong account of stuff and I'm the only one. But regardless, I'm like, 
how does that happen? It'd be different if it was just one person remembering it wrong, but everybody really does make you wonder if you're living in the matrix. <laughs> Here lately in the last like 10 times I've done makeup I've gotten mascara right there every single time every single time y'all I'm like why it's literally in the same exact spot every time I just need to, because sometimes I get too excited and I open my eyes and then literally everything I just did is ruined from my mascara. So. Hi guys, it is several hours later. Um, my friend had called me right after and we left immediately. Um, we got back about two o'clock. We ate, um... Thai food while we were in Louisville. Mm. It was so good. And then I took a nap when I got home because I was exhausted. I woke up at like 4 o'clock to go. I ended up using this lipstick. Which looked good when I first put it on. It actually looks decent right now. But I got this like weird like yellowy tan color after it faded after lunch so that was weird but like and I had some uh, fried curry mm. Mm. delicious mm. anyway appointment went good my friend's much more comfortable with the new doctor and uh they're going to be scheduling a, a surgery soon, so. But thank you guys so much for watching. Um, I appreciate you sticking with me on this very weird video. And uh, I love you guys so much, so I'll see you guys in the next one. Yeah. Bye.